Baby, this year it's just gonna be you and me Hanging by the fire chairs, isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memory Good morning everyone, it's Monday the 2nd of December, so Vlogmas Day 2 I, it's 6.30 a.m. I'm just finishing making Rich's lunch and then I'm gonna get in the car and go to work. So we both like having the Warburton sandwich thins. Um, Rich loves jam, so I just do him a jam sandwich in a fat sandwich fin. So you're gonna do this and get in the car. Also has a jammy wagon wheel, skips, and a Barney. <laughs> so it's like a little kid's lunch box, he loves it. Good morning from the car. It's not the best lighting, but I'll just flip you around because we're all frozen up. 6.46. I've just put de-icer on, but we're gonna have to wait a little while. I may have to get out and scrape it if it doesn't go. <laughs> so yeah, it's minus 0.0, .0 uh, Celsius, which I think is about 31 or 30 Fahrenheit. So yeah, I'm very ready to have the heart Christmas music ready to go, let's see. So while we wait for that, um, I know it's not the best light, but my uh, commute is about 45 minutes. I prefer going early, so I would rather go um, like 6.45 and avoid the traffic um, than go later. So um, yeah, excited to get on with the day. It's just when you have to allow extra time for <laughs> the cold weather. Good morning, happy Monday. Let me just turn the blowers down. Wow, it is frosty this morning. Happy Monday, uh, day two of Vlogmas, and it's scraping the car day today. It is super cold, scarf on, big fluffy jacket on. So I'm gonna show you what my view is right now. This is the delights of a Monday morning. Oh yes, <laughs> I've tried the de-icer. It's not cutting it, so it's gonna be a case of getting out the car and scraping this. Wish me luck. Good afternoon. I'm just on my lunch break at the moment. It's just t about 10 to three. Um, you'll get to know this, but I have quite a late lunch so that I have a shorter afternoon. Um, and generally speaking, mornings are just crazy busy. And then before you know it, it's like two o'clock and it's lunchtime. So I'm gonna pop into town right now. Luke's given me some bits to post. We've been selling a few things on eBay. So I'm going to drop those off at the post office and um, on a bit of a mission as well. So I'm going to, we've been looking for, truth be told, we've been looking for the orange 12s, which came out, I think a couple of months ago, but cannot see them anywhere. We've not been able to find them anywhere. Luke likes orange chocolate. So um, I saw online yesterday that apparently WH Smith has them and the post office is in WH Smith. So I'm gonna have a little nose in there to see if it's there. Um, and I'll keep you updated as to whether I can find it and give Luke a little surprise later. <laughs> for the Cadbury's Orange 12 continues. Dubrate Smith, well not in ours anyway, so no doubt they're gonna be in a Dubrate Smith, probably near London, but here they're not there. So the search continues. But I thought I'd get a bit of footage of the Christmas decorations in our local town centre. So hopefully you enjoyed that. But now it's time to go back to work. Good evening, it is now coming up to six o'clock and I'm home. So long day, long Monday, glad it's out of the way and keep thinking um, one step closer to Christmas. <laughs> so I've just got home, one cat here, and then Willow, if we just turn the light on in the garden, is out over there. So it's a bit cold, so we won't keep her out for long. But she's off on her little mission that she does when she gets home. Oh. There she is, off on her little adventure. <laughs> she has to do a little perimeter of the whole garden. This is out. Nope, I said no on that one. Too cold. So I've got 
popped to the shop at lunch today at work and I got some Quality Street, 3 99 in Lidl. A classic for Christmas. You get all the famous ones. They've put all three decent ones there. And they've got the orange and the strawberry. And these are a real staple of Christmas. So I got them while they were 3 99 because I thought that was a good so deal. I also got some pasta sauce for tomorrow. And I got some cookies, which look a lot like Maryland, but they're not. <laughs> and the normal ritual is to come home and get the candles lit. So I'm gonna get them all nicely done. This one is, um, let's just see, cinnamon spiced vanilla. I don't wanna come out very well, but I'm gonna get the candles lit and make it all nice and homely and get the tree lights. We've got one of these hive heating systems which are really cool so uh, I haven't programmed it properly yet we've had it for a while but obviously I can just go like that and it will turn the heat on so that's going to put it up to 18 because it's 15 in here and it's cold so I'm going to get the house all warmed up and uh, get nice and snug. So the hive also has a little box on the wall so you can see what the temperature is there as well and then we've also got our lovely pictures in the hallway Japan pavilion I miss it so much and then the beautiful boardwalk. Honestly, love these pictures so much. So it's time to pick a new candle. So I'm heading over to the candle cupboard to pick a seasonal candle. So let's all have a the candles are in here, and the top shelf is all the festive ones, which I organised recently. So I'm not sure what we're going to go for, but I'm feeling it's time for a marshmallow fireside, which is one of my favourite seasonal ones. Um, and then obviously down there are the non seasonal or just other seasons so let's go for a marshmallow fireside because it is so this one is warm blend of toasted marshmallows smoldering woods and cream of vanilla reminiscent of a cozy evening round the bonfire that sounds lovely all changed into some comfy clothes nothing better um so i'm now going to feed the cats because you're going to hear some very excitable cats you're hungry yeah, they're both down there waiting for their food. So, gonna get on with these the cats now. Ready? So, Rich is out tonight with work. So, hopefully he's filming something. He's going off for a nice all-you-can-eat Chinese, which is really nice with his colleagues. Um, because I'm on my own, I'm gonna just throw something together. So, let's see what we can so I'm going with a bit of a salad tonight because when it's just one of us, we don't really wanna cook. So, we've got some potato salad, lettuce, some lovely couscous, some hummus with some crackers and some cucumber. So I'm just gonna knock that up and I'll show you the crackers. So these crackers are so good. They say new, but they've been around for a couple of months now. Um, but they're rosemary and sea salt flatbreads and they're so delicious, especially with hummus. So that is gonna be me. Exciting. Good evening. So work is done. And once again, I find myself in a car park. I feel like I was thinking on the way here, I feel like all I've done today is vlog from on my phone from a car park. Um, but I am out with work colleagues tonight. So every few months or so, we make the effort to get together and just go for an informal meal, just nothing special, just nip into town, have some dinner and chat and yeah, just try and talk about things other than work, although I'm sure work will come up. Um, so we're gonna head into town and we've decided to go to a place called Tangs, T-A-N-G-S, which is relatively new to the town centre. It's like a buffet, well it is a buffet, with different cuisines. There's like Indian, Japanese, Chinese, Mediterranean, I think I'm missing one. But anyway, you get the picture. So I'm hoping to take my phone in with me and film a little bit of the food. I never like to promise in case it doesn't happen because sometimes you just don't know how the evening's gonna pan out. Um, but hopefully it's appropriate enough for me to do a little bit of filming. Um, and sorry in advance if I make you hungry. So yeah, and uh, I'll catch up with you when I'm home again. <laughs>
chilling had socks with me um just feel really tired it's monday <laughs> but someone else is with me now hello <laughs> we're back together again we're back so we're gonna make some nice tea so rich went into town at lunch to post um something for me for ebay mm -hmm. and because also got a present for someone in america one of my friends <laughs> um, but one of the things we want to say is you guys are really kind and you send us stuff sometimes to our PO box which is listed below and it's so nice to get stuff we've been saving stuff up so if you've sent stuff recently sorry we haven't vlogged about it because we haven't been doing vlogs it's been a bit chaotic but we thought with vlogmas coming out it'd be a perfect opportunity to say thank you to show it on the vlog yeah we're gonna do it regularly so uh, obviously over the christmas period you guys are so kind and we've got loads of great stuff we've been putting them all in a big box and we're like every time they're coming we're like take a picture put them in the box so we're just going to show you guys what we've got now um i still can't believe people send us stuff and it's so thought we're through. so grateful and it's lovely the thought that goes into the the gifts is just and we never expect it so thank <laughs> you so much thank you let's show you anyway hello. it's just sitting there hello what are you doing? I've just had her in my arms, purring her little head off. She's looking at Rich, look. She loves Rich. Yeah. She missed him. You miss me. So how was your dinner? Oh, I'm so full. <laughs> just Chinese again. It's a, it's a treat because on the weekends we have a little treat, a few treats, and the, in the week we tend to be good, don't we? Yeah. So on a Monday, that's well, very unusual. here as well. Hello. They're all, all around <laughs> Rich, look, he's been out. All the love. Oh, all the love. So yeah, it was nice. I've been sitting with my blanket all nice over there. <laughs> Such a nice blanket. Sorry. Yes, no cats allowed. <laughs> Sorry. So let's show you the P.O. Box items. So you can see all the cat's toys everywhere. This is Willow's strawberry. She's had it since she was a baby. Willow's had this little strawberry toy since she was a baby. And she still carries it around. Oh, she just bumped into us. She still walks around with it. And Socks is not interested. <laughs> So here are the lovely, lovely P.O. Box gifts we've got. Wow. I'm going to let Rich start, because some of them were Rich's so birthday kind. presents. Yeah. I mean, I'm just going to, there's no particular order, so no one's taking preference, but yeah. The tea. <laughs> the tea. <laughs> the Suckle card. So it's Genie. Genie. So Genie from Mark Gilbert. And this is, like Luke says, a happy birthday. I hope you have a great day. It was awesome. And some apple tea from Fortnum and Mason. Not you, just any tea. Not just any tea. Fortnum and Mason. Your Mark, favorite. you know me very well because this is literally one of my favourite teas ever. <laughs> Thank you so, so much. Thanks, Mark. And also it came in really cool Harry Potter wrapping, which was really good. Yes. Thank um, you very much. I'm going to pick out this amazing picture, which has been painted, and it's so good. Um, it obviously summarises alien... Mickey in his Hawaii outfit, Olu, Chippendale, Stitch, and it's got like a Hawaiian scene to it. This is what we mean when we say like the thought that goes into these. And this was, dear Rich and Luke, Luke and Rich, a small thanks for the evening of joy and pleasure you've given me watching your wonderful vlogs on the Disney trip. Um, and it was from Davey. Dream away. Dream away. So thank you so much for that. That's I mean, so lovely. Look at that. I mean, the time, the effort. I love it. And it glistens. If you can see in, in the... Trying. Yeah, if you move it, Rich, it glistens. I love it. Sparkly. It's such a lovely memento of Hawaii. So thank you so much for taking the time to do that. It's thank beautiful. you. But I'm seeing some aliens right here. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Loving the aliens. We've got this cool alien car, which I'd never seen before. Um, and this was from Siobhan, Michael, Alfie, Kobe, Riley, Oscar and Roman. And hope you have a great birthday and amazing time in Florida. So nice. All the characters and even an alien on the inside as well. So thank you Siobhan and her family. Thank you so much for loving that card. And that's got... Aliens. <laughs> aliens. Aria, Freshna. There's so many aliens in this picture right now. <laughs> <laughs> a lovely note as well. 
So thank you for all your hard work with all your vlogs. Myself and my family really enjoys watching them and have them near enough. Watched every single one, some multiple times. <laughs> oh. Wow, thank you so much. They are really helping me plan our first trip to Florida next year. Oh, have an amazing time. To have an amazing time, guys. Thank you so much. Like the Harry Potter notes I well. love this. We're going to make this puzzle as part of Christmas. Oh, yes. My own alien puzzle. <laughs> <laughs> Willow's very jealous right now. <laughs> I think she's going to come up. You're going to go up. You want to be involved? Yeah, there she goes. Here we go. She just seen the tree. You've not seen that tree before. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> She's very happy about finding the tree. We'd hidden it from her. It's not a real tree. They're nice. She's just really happy that Rich is home. So happy. Yeah. You missed me, haven't you? Yeah. Yeah, and the tree takes priority though. That's going to be going over in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone wanted more Willow in the vlog. Here you go. Vlogs with Willow. That sounds quite catchy actually. Yeah. Vlogs with Willow. If we get Willow and Nan together, that would be popular. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm just looking at this lovely note from Roxy. Um, I love Disney and I love to watch your vlogs. I have been to Disneyland Paris three times with my mum and dad. First time is when we've stayed in the Santa Fe Hotel. We've stayed there. Uh, great theming, uh, and also Sequoia Lodge, and she did the Forest Club as well. Um, and I have to say, Roxy, really good handwriting. Yeah, really yeah, good. Really good. I don't think I wrote like that at your age. <laughs> <laughs> and we want to say a huge thank you to our friend Adam for sending us. Adam Hatton sent us his new dream guide for Disney Cruise Line. So he kindly sent us a copy and signed it. So it was lovely to meet you more at Disney World. So we met Adam um, in Epcot in front of Soaring. So that is so cool. So we're looking forward to going through this. Mm -hmm. Oh, Disney Cruise, so exciting. So he's put a book together all about Disney Cruise and it does look really amazing. So check that out. We're going to have a good look through because <laughs> we've only done the three night cruise on the dream so it'd be good to get some tips for some of the smaller ships um and it's got like hustaway key we've just been there oh, so lovely <laughs> so thank you so much adam while well, there's a little interlude we've got willow here what's going on willow <laughs> what are you up to she wants us to get the second bauble on from the advent calendars so next up we got a lovely gift from our friends in Australia. All the way from Australia, so far. Uh, this is from uh, Becky, Paul, Michael, Max and Nate. And they were heading off to Orlando um, for their first trip. In 52 days, and the date they wrote this note. So they must have been by now, so guys. Yeah, we know. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you had an amazing time. Yes, um, and I love the bit at the bottom, P.S. I sign up for Bath and Body Works, lots of emails. Oh, excellent, <laughs> I love that. <laughs> so thank you so much for the note. It was very lovely to read. And also having Mickey and um, the alien on there as well, which is really cool. Yes. Um, and also sent us this cool Australian money pouch with the Australian money. And um, Beck and family sent us so many cool things from Australia before, which we loved. We've actually got some Australian money upstairs. I know I want to go to Australia even more. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Literally, I've been bugging Luke about Australia. <laughs> um, next up, we've got this lovely Christmas card. This is actually our first Christmas card from Jay. Roxburgh. So Jay, you are officially the first. The first, so thank you so much. It's such a cute little card. In this one, we have got a little note and it's from Bliss Candle Company. Mm -hmm. And they've done a little Luke and Rich. Let's see if we can get this to focus. Focus. It says Luke and Rich and it's a cherry, cherry marshmallow. marshmallow. And it says, thank you for the vlogs. Let's smell oh, it. Oh, it smells so good. Oh wow, yeah. thank you so much guys, that's lovely. Okay, next up we've got this little gift here. And this is from Anthony. And he's given us stuff from Tokyo. Tokyo, I miss Tokyo so much. There's a first year water bottle holder from Mickey. That's just so, it's just so Japan. Yeah. <laughs> um, there's an alien sticker set for you. Oh, I'm loving the aliens here. And there's a haunted mansion. I think it's a little note set. It looks like a set of notes, let's have a look. That'd be very Japanese. <laughs> Tokyo is just too nice. Yeah, it's like post-it yeah, notes. Post-it notes. Wow, that's so cool. Literally, Japan, Tokyo, they think of everything. Thank you so much, Anthony. 
And finally, we've got this lovely gift in a Disney bag, which I love this bag. Gotta love a Disney bag. Um, and this is a lovely gift from Teresa and Emma. And they said, Luke and Rich, we started watching your channel this year and we have enjoyed it immensely. We live in the middle of the United States, so we don't get to the parks as much as we would like. And watching your vlogs helps us get our Disney fix when we, found, when we need it. We found these items in clothes in the Disney stores on Thought of You. Thank you so much. Oh, oh so wow. sweet. Alien socks. Alien socks. Mickey socks. If you're going to have socks, there's got to be alien socks. Look at this. This is just amazing. I've been chosen. <laughs> You've got the core is our master <laughs> notepad. This is so cool for you. Yeah. I can see you at work in your meetings with that. Oh, yes. I'll be the talk of the meetings. And really cute pins. So Mickey and Mickey. Oh, and some high chews. High chews. Thank you so much, guys. We've resisted these high chews for a while, so I think we've deserved it now. We've earned it. Yeah, thank <laughs> you. And Willow is still there. <laughs> Where is it, Willow? You're not liking the fact that you're not getting attention, no. are you? Thank you again for that. So nice of you guys. Yes. Thank you. So yesterday we did the trivia in the advent calendar and we asked you guys what was Sven from Frozen's favourite food. Yeah. You guys have all answered, but the answer is... Carrots! Carrots. Yeah. <laughs> not the hardest one in the world, but let's find out what today's is. So hold there. Yes. I'm going to grab it. And I've actually been seeing the comments come up on my phone um, whilst I've been at work today, so well done everyone. Let's go for number two. Yes. This is a surprise for me because Rich did this on his own, so it's been his little project. <laughs> so number two. I can't remember the question now. <laughs> wow, okay. In Pinocchio, he and his father are consumed by a massive blue whale. What was its name? What was its name? That's number two. Pinocchio was consumed by... A massive whale. What was the name of the whale? Yeah. So no googling. Comment no below. search engine. <laughs> comment below and let us know, and we'll let you know the answer tomorrow. Yes. So and so pleased that you guys seem to be liking this idea. Um, we'll do it next year. And I'm going to grab the other advent calendar here. Yes. Here we go, the Mickey Bauble one. Mm -hmm. So it's my turn today to do number two. Yeah. I really should have rehearsed this to save time. <laughs> here we go. So if anyone else has got the same calendar, sorry if you're seeing this here first. Yeah, hopefully sorry. by the time, the fact we're uploading a day late means you've done yours. <laughs> We've got this one. Oh, it's, I really like that one. That reminds me of Frozen. Frozen. Let's hang That's it on the... very Frozen-esque bauble. I'm going to go there. There we are. Yeah, there we go. Let's do the other end thing. There we go. So, shall I go first? You go first. Okay. Ooh. Lift up there. Oh, I'm trying to do it with one hand. I, I'll hold the camera. Multitasking. Oh, number two. Number two. See, it's yeah. nice and easy because it's in order. It's in order. This is like my perfect uh, advent calendar. What flavour is that one? Okay, this one is organic green tea with Garcinia, cinnamon, ginseng, ginseng, ginseng sorry, and acai berry. Acai. Acai. So let's... Um... You're going to have that tonight, aren't you? I'm going to have it tonight. And I'll let yeah, you guys know exactly what it's like. And I'm going to have some more of this. Actually, I may have this tea or I may have... I must say, the Harrods breakfast tea is now probably my favourite. And trust it to be one of the most expensive teas on the planet. So, um, we'll see. And then this calendar. Yeah, I'm going to take the camera. I'm guessing it's going to be... Uh, <laughs> wax melt. But will they tell you what scent it is? No. It's you gotta guess. Nine six oh one. Nine six oh one. It smells nice. <laughs> it smells That's nice. literally what it says on the side. Nine six oh one. And there's yesterday's one which I haven't burnt yet. I really think they should say on these little windows what they are. Yeah, but yeah, that was yesterday's tea. You did say that you really, really enjoyed that tea. Yes, this was it's empty. But it actually the, the ingredients together sound a bit random, but it works. And I'm hoping this orange one. Is this well, I put the one, num one number one back in so you didn't remember what it is. Yeah, in it goes. So let's boil the kettle. We also recently visited our friends at Ocean Florida and they gave us a really cute gift. Each. Very cute. Even the box, it's got chipping down on the side, so OMG. So nice. What is it? Dun, dun, dun. <gasps> oh, it's got a Disney. Disney paper, Disney wrapping. Oh, Look wow. Look at that. Built-in cookie pockets. I love that. Compartment pour biscuit in <gasps> That is so cool. I've got one as well. And that's the front. 
It's living holiday cheer. Aww. That's so perfect for us. Disney mugs and they hold cookies. Like, can you get any better than and that? And there's, there's little Mickeys falling out. Little Mickey. Can you see them? <laughs> oh, thanks so much, guys, thanks at Ocean, guys Florida. Ocean Florida. Thank you very much. Love that. The mugs have been chosen. Rich is actually on the left. And, I, and he's gone for the Christmassy one. Oh, sorry, OCD, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> left for Luke. Right for it. And I've gone for the Tokyo Disney Where Dreams Come True mug, which I absolutely love this one. It's got all the characters on it. It's not focusing very well today. It's like a, it is like semi blurred that bit. Starbucks. Look at that, the castle and the castle. Let's Monday Monday's done. And we just want to say, I know the weekdays are not very exciting. We work long days and don't have that much of an exciting life outside of the park. <laughs> we wake up, we go to work. <laughs> <laughs> but we're determined to have Christmas spirit. And yes. this week we have got a few things planned. I think I'm a bit blurry right now. I don't know what's going on with this camera. There we go. Yeah, it's not very happy. So yeah, we've got some cool stuff coming up through the Vlogmas. Mm -hmm. Some exciting yes. stuff. Um, we've got a weekend away coming up this weekend coming. Um, nowhere abroad, but <laughs> it's in the UK, so it's going to be nice and exciting. Sometimes it's nice to explore your own country. It yeah. is. And then, yeah, we're seeing Kelly on Wednesday. Yes. So we're going to see my mum Thursday. So we've got we've got bits Plans. planned. We've got an exciting weekend coming up, and there's some other bits and pieces. We need to go to IKEA. <laughs> we do. We actually do. We need to go to Costco because these are all Christmas tick-off bits. Yeah. So we're going to have a cup of tea now and get an early night. The Quality Street have been opened. What do we say, Rich? Dun dun dun. A purple <laughs> one. And there's so. Fewer than we were expecting in here. They seem to be getting smaller every so year. I'm just going to finish the vlog off this evening and tell you guys how how nice this tea is. I did taste a sip before I went on camera, but I wanted another sip to make sure I actually liked it. But it's nice. It's different, but I prefer yesterday's. So yeah, it's still a thumbs up. So yeah, I like it. So we'll see you tomorrow for day three. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Christmas memories